So in this video, I want to talk about the autonomic innervation of the eye. So we know that the sympathetic nervous system mediates mydriasis, which is a fancy term for pupillary dilation. Why is that? Because the sympathetic nervous system is our fight and flight response, and it equips us for the worst case scenario. What is the worst case scenario? A lion could attack us in the dark. And so we would still we would need to be able to see in the dark. How can we see in the dark? Well, if our pupils dilate, well, then we're going to collect as much as light as possible and we will be able to see in the night. Which smooth muscles are going to be responsible for mediating pupillary dilation? So let's look at our eye. This is the iris and here I have drawn the pupil. So the pupil is surrounded by two different smooth muscles. So there's one circular smooth muscle around it and then we have the radial smooth muscle which looks like spikes on a wheel. Now, if we want to mediate mydriasis, pupillary dilation, that could happen if this radial smooth muscle actually contracts. Imagine this radial smooth muscle contracts, so we're going to bring in this muscle, we're going to um, have it a little bit smaller in here, so the pupil is going to be pulled out. And in fact, we find alpha-1 receptors sitting here, and this is the pupillary dilator muscle. So it has a nice name because it already tells you what's the effect going to be. It dilates the pupil. But to do so, um, it needs contraction. So the sympathetic nervous system actually mediates contraction of pupillary dilator muscle. And that's going to be mediated via alpha-1 receptors. Now let's look what the parasympathetic nervous system is doing. Well, there's also this circular muscle around it. And we find here M3 receptors. Now, if you contract the circular muscle, the pupil is going to get smaller. So we have contraction of this muscle. And this is called the pupillary constrictor muscle. And again, a very nice name because it tells you the effect. So the parasympathetic nervous system mediates contraction of the pupillary constrictor muscle. And this is mediated by M3. This concludes the video on the autonomic innervation of the eye.